lost technology. That's what radionics is, a, a lost technology. This uh, healing machine I made in 1973 or 74. It's got prayer batteries on it and a tuning coil in the middle, which is isolated in space, but it's not actually floating there. There's a piece of um, perspex holding that in place, insulating it. And then there's these wires and uh, these other electrical components. The Fairy Society use prayer batteries and every year they have a meeting up on Brown Willie on Bodmin Moor where George King who was a founder of the Ethereum Society encountered a, a silver being from outer space every year they do this pilgrimage to where in 1957 I believe it was George King encountered this being got these messages also in their practice they use these prayer batteries the batteries are charged with prayer and the idea is that they've got lots of prayer power installed so whenever the world is in peril they can release this prayer back into the world to help healing it so when they were formed there was uh, a lot of fear about nuclear holocaust the early spiritualists in the turn of the century were getting these voices from the spirits of dead people and historical figures. George King was getting them from uh, people on Mars. I went to this healing up in London and they were holding these shapes over somebody and it was stuff borrowed from Egyptian ritual. This photograph of uh, a pyramid, this geometrical form I also made this in 1973 from uh, this mirrored plastic rather than out of huge great blocks of stone. It's made out of what I had available. Salvaged from shop window displays and bamboo. And this is erected, this visionary place, in a roundabout in Chesterfield, Lord's Mill Street roundabout. And it's lined up with the uh, pyramid in Egypt.